can hear it. Can you? Dawn Grace held her face against 55-year-old Joseph Hansen's chest to hear and feel her son Kalen's beating heart for the first time since his death in 2012. Kalen was just 14 years old when he accidentally shot himself with a gun that he thought was defective. He pulled the trigger and it didn't go off. So he pulled the trigger again and it didn't go off and he was telling them that, say it don't work. So then he put it to his head and it went off. When I was asked to donate, I was very angry. I thought they were crazy. So I went home and I sat in the recliner that he always sat in. And uh, he come to me and he said, Mama, what would I do? Joe Hansen was diagnosed with hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, making it difficult for his heart to pump blood and was placed on the transplant list in 2012. Six months after receiving Kalen's heart, Joe wrote a letter to the Grace family and they wrote back including photos of Kalen. From day one, all I could think about was the young man. That's all I could think about. As soon as you open my wallet, this is the first thing. That was his last school picture. Since learning about Kalen's story, Joe enrolled in a local community college and wants to inspire people to become registered organ donors. After long phone calls and emails, Dawn and her family traveled to Iowa to meet Joe for the very first time. I'm glad we did it. And I heard my baby's heartbeat. I can hear it. Can you? If he knew he could save a life, he would do it. No questions asked. I think we made a great decision. I think Kalen is looking down on me and he's he's proud of what his mama did. Be sure to watch Inside Edition.